The fourth rule of patch management is the reboot action. After we apply patches to a machine, we often have to reboot. And you can tell Kaseya how you want to accomplish that. We usually have two defaults. For workstations, we do what's called ask to reboot every 60 minutes. And that's this one right here. If the user is logged in, it will ask them to reboot. A little pop-up will come up on the screen. It'll say patch has been applied. Do you want to reboot? Yes or no? If they say no, it'll basically go to sleep and it'll come back an hour later and pr prompt them again. And this will go on and on and on until they either agree or reboot their machine or call you to complain. So, you know, in a perfect world, you want, to you want to do this after hours with them logged off of their machine because if they're logged off their machine, it just reboots right away. So if you're applying patches at 9 o'clock at night and you've trained them to, to log off every day, this will not be an issue. They'll simply get uh, logged off right away. On servers, it's a different animal, and there's a lot of different ways of handling that. Uh, sometimes it, uh, we just reboot on Sundays at 3 a.m. That's a default for us, and that might work for um, simple servers. If you have a uh, schedule where you're applying patches only once a week, so your automatic update says that it's only once a week at, at 3 o'clock in the morning, then I would reboot immediately after an update. For that, for that server. Because you're only applying patches once a week at 3 in the morning, that's the only time that it could possibly need a reboot, and therefore it's going to reboot immediately after it, it patches. And that, that allows you to apply patches and get that reboot in right away, um, which reduces the, the chances that a service got stopped during the, the patch update, and it, the, the Microsoft was expecting you to reboot the machine, um, and it wasn't getting rebooted, and therefore you've got a service down until the, the machine is rebooted or you manually start the service back up. The other option that's very popular with people is this one. Do not reboot after an update. When a reboot's required, just send you an email. And basically an email will go out and let you know, hey, ABC server has to be rebooted, and you'll go and manually reboot it or schedule a reboot at appropriate time. Thank you.